Hey guys, I am Rajat and today in this video, I will show you how you can install Zenex OS 1.8 in your Samsung Exynos 7870 devices. Before we start, I just want to say many of you guys just watching my videos are not subscribed yet. So please subscribe, I just want to reach 1k in this year. By the way, to install the Zenex OS ROM, all you need to do is turn off your device and boot it to your custom recovery mode by pressing the home button, power key and the volume up key at the same time. Now if you are an earlier subscriber then you might have seen that in the previous two installation videos I have used the orange box recovery. But I came back to TWRP recovery again cause in this recovery I can use a OTG adapter which is not possible in orange box recovery. Now after opening the custom recovery mode you have to wipe your device. For that just go to wipe and then advanced wipe and wipe your Delvic art cache system data and cache. As you can see that my device has been wiped successfully. So let me just show you the zip files that you need for installing this ROM. And for the installation I am using a OTG adapter. Don't be confused here, you just need to go to install and have to select your storage. Now the first zip file that you need for installing this ROM is the create vendor zip file. Second thing that you need for installing this ROM is the image file of the Zenex OS ROM. Third thing that you need is the Google Apps zip file and fourth one is the age vendor. All the links of the zip files and the image file has given in the description box. To install the ROM first of all flash the create vendor zip file. Now once you have installed the create vendor zip file reboot your recovery mode. Now just again go to installed and select your storage and flash the image file of the Zenex OS ROM as system image. Do hold on because the installation of the image file will take a large amount of time. As you can see that the image file has successfully installed. Now if you just want to go back and flash the Google app package, this process gets failed. Even if you want to resize your system size, this will get failed too. Let me show you by doing that. As you can see that I am getting failed again and again. Now to solve this, first of all flash the age vendor zip file. Now just tap on reboot system and then do not install. By that your device will be booted but still there is a problem that you will see in the later of this video. As you can see that the device has been booted successfully but the problem is the play store is absent here without which the system is not usable. Now to add play store in the system, just turn off your device and boot it to your custom recovery mode like previous. Now just again go to wipe and then advanced wipe and select your system and tap on repair or change file system. Now go to resize file system and swipe the arrow to the right side. Now the resizing process in the first time will get failed. For that just go back and select again the resize file system and swipe the arrow to the right side. Now just go to install, select your storage and flash the google app package zip file. Now 
now just again select reboot system and then do not install let's check the play store has been added or not as you can see that the play store has been added successfully now so this is all about the installation of the Xenex OS ROM and in terms of connectivity the Wi-Fi Bluetooth everything works good if you have any query regarding this video you can ask me through the comments so that's it for today please subscribe this channel and guys I will see you in the next one bye bye